help for the senator pass they gave to us because it has it has been a, a very big help to me. My auntie she used to buy pass for me, but it doesn't used to be enough. So I'm saying thank you for them to them because of the card they gave to us and I'm very grateful. And on behalf of the girls, they were very happy the day the Rokivka Foundation came to give give out the senatory pass. They appreciated it so much that some of them even asked me if I could, could give them the one that was given to me. But I told them no, that me myself I needed to. So we are appreciating Rokiv Foundation for the senatory pass they gave out to us. The girls asked if they could buy, but the auntie said no because the pass are for free. There are samples that they are giving out to students who need the pass. And even all of us, we, we wanted to get it, but because of the population of the students, we couldn't get the pass much. And we are appreciating them for that because they have given us much, much more what we needed more. Because of we girls, we need pass, and but, but sometimes the people we live with don't buy it for us. But we are always... We always need it because it's always a monthly flow. So we need the pad, but we are not. We don't have the opportunity to get it. But the foundation was able to give it to us. So we are appreciating them for that. Thanks. I really appreciate what you people have done this afternoon. I pray that God in His infinite goodness will bless you people abundantly for your kind gesture. Thank you very much. to protect yourself since you already know what it is. Huh? So now we are talking about a whole lot. The hygiene during your menstrual flow. It's not enough. Just say menstruation is the flow of blood, blah blah blah. When the blood is flowing, do you just walk and move about? No. You, you don't have to. You need to protect yourself. Hmm? You need to do what? Protect yourself. As you are protecting yourself, you are also abiding by some hygienic rules. Those rules are there to protect you from being infected. Because remember, it's your body. As it is flowing out, any little mistake you make, you get infection. In those good old days, our mothers, they had a way of doing, you know, observing their period. I was once told that they, they normally dig a hole on the ground. They get another chair. They drill a hole on that chair, put it over that hole, and they'll be sitting on top of it. Which means you cannot move out. You'll be there so long as there's that flow. But thanks to uh, civilization, these days, even if you are menstruating, you can even swim. You move about. You go to wherever you want to go. Courtesy of the sanitary towels that you use in protecting yourself. In those good old days, they didn't know about sanitary towels. So that's why they limit themselves to sitting down in one place. Would you like to sit down in one place when you are menstruating? No. You wouldn't like to do so. So today we are going to tell you about sanitary hygiene as regards your uh, menstrual flow. Okay? Yes. Now, if you look on top of this table now, you will see some protection, some sanitary towels. These days there are different types in the market. Okay? Yes. So you choose whichever one that is suitable for you. Now, if you are menstruating, of course, you need to clean your body. You need to take your bath. 